I've been close to the newlyweds for a few short years, but they've been filled with so many awesome memories. First time I met Keaton, I'll admit I was unsure about him. He was this awkward guy who bragged too much about UCF and talked way too fast to understand. We finally became great friends, now there's no uncertainty. He's this awkward guy who brags way too much about UCF and talks way too fast to understand. But I can say he has one of the most genuine hearts and he loves his now wife more than anything. I'm thankful to call him a friend. Stop crying. We got that little bit of everything, little bit of everything. Hey, I see the magic in your everything, little bit of everything. Hey. Stacy, growing up, we were so different. We had a lot of different interests and hobbies. We were rarely on the same page and sometimes not even in the same book. But there's never been a question that you always had my back, my best interests in mind, and I always admired how good of a friend you were to your friends, your passion, and how you love with your whole heart and your refusal to ever settle. Which brings me to Keaton. <laughs> He probably didn't wear fish shirts and have a mullet. <laughs> but here we are. <laughs> you seamlessly complete our family. And I've never met someone who can so calmly diffuse the situation if Stacy is frustrated or make Stacy laugh as hard as you do. A successful relationship is not only about finding the right partner, it's about being the right partner. And we wouldn't be here today if that wasn't the case. Hey, baby. Are you okay? <laughs> I have something for you. Just keep your shit together. Oh, no. <laughs> it's gorgeous. Oh, you can wait, it's fine. Okay. Welcome to the marriage ceremony of Stacy and Keaton. They stand before you today to declare their commitment to each other in front of family, friends, God, and to celebrate with you on this wonderful occasion. Many of you have given them much happiness, love, warmth, and guidance throughout their lives. Stacy and Keaton have not arrived at this place alone. Though this is a day of celebration, this journey begins long before these two people ever knew. It's about the road they took to get to this moment and to their commitment to do so together. have known each other for four years. Their relationship has grown despite their many differences, but one constant throughout this time for them has been each other. It takes a lifetime of love and compromise to make marriage durable and everlasting. It is a bold step into an unknown future. Marriage is risking who we are for the sake of who we can be. I promise to love you from this day forward. I will laugh you in happiness and console you in sorrow. I promise to be your companion and offer my lifelong support in every part of your dreams. These things I give you today and all the days of our lives. 
I promise to love you from this day forward. I will laugh with you in happiness and console you in sorrow. I promise to be your companion and offer you lifelong support in every part of your dreams. The things I give to you today and all the days of our lives. I now declare that you are husband and wife and the moment you have all been waiting for. Keaton, you may kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you Mr. and Mrs. William Keaton Cross. Keaton is now officially part of our family. It's not a large family and is sometimes wonky, but we will be there to support and love you always. Stacy, you're a beautiful bride, and I am so proud of all you have accomplished. You have always loved with all your heart, and I am so happy that you have found the right someone to share that love with. So let's get this first adventure on Stacy and Keaton's journey started. You have no idea just how much you've affected us and helped us to become the ladies we are today. She's not only our babysitter, tumbling coach, swim coach, cheer coach, hairstylist, and driver, but she's also our role model. We love you both and are so excited and honored to share this special day with you. And we hope you have lots of babies we get to babysit. <laughs>